Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of The First Look, I'm going to be your host Vikings and today we're going to take a first look at Dark Ocean which is an indie horror survival game developed by a group of students from, I'm going to attempt to pronounce this, Universidad Pompeu Fabra, at least I think that's how you pronounce it. Now, the game is free to download and play from the official website and it's also on Steam Greenlight so go on over there and give it some love, you have all necessary links in the description as usual. So, we have a free game developed by a group of students. Let's see what they've managed to accomplish. Check out the options menu. Now, the first gripe I have with the game is you can't change the resolution. I've messed around with the files a little bit and tried to change the resolution that way, but all I've managed to do is mess up the menu and the way things are arranged. It didn't actually change the in-game resolution, so there we go. And the resolution that we're gonna have to play it at is 2080 by 720 so there you go guys just because you have a couple of options for the sounds and lighting and that's about it instructions you also can't rebind the keys that's another thing i don't really like but there aren't too many of them to worry about so i guess it's not that big of a deal camera flash change weapons and you got a few fuel spray a few instructions there so, let's start the game, uh, do keep in mind there will be spoilers from this point on, I'm not going to skip any cutscenes. Let's take a look at it. In the darkest of moments of life is when our true value is revealed. My name is Liz, I'm a marine engineer, and this is the ship I've designed. Tonight an unknown disease has taken over the ship and its passengers. I don't know if I'm the only survivor. I think I'm alone. My only chance is escaping through the casino. I won't let them drag me to the dark ocean. So, there you go. The voice acting is pretty good so far. Usually, voice acting kind of sucks in, in the games, but that gal managed to do a pretty fine job, so that's good. I also like the music so far. The introductory uh, track that was in the menu was really nice and eerie. So, you know, good job on the sound assets so far. And here we are in the game, and as you can see the graphics are not amazing, not that you would expect. And honestly, you don't really play a game like this for the graphics anyway. Play for the trails and scares and... Oh crap. That's seldom a good sign. What the... Okay, shoot. What? There we go. Dead little zombie. <laughs> Take that. So, it's cool, it looks like you can... Yeah, there we go, flare gun. You light the zombies on fire, that's very nice. And it looks like the aim is a toggle, actually. That's always good to note. Let's see, what do we got over here? Oh no, the floor has fallen down. I can't go to the casino through the main entrance. I'll have to go through the pool first. I need to go to the elevator at the far end of the hall to get there. Hmm. It's a little bit disappointing uh, she didn't carry out with the voice acting. Because like I said, she was doing a pretty good job. Okay, go to the swimming pool through the elevator on the far end of the hall. Okay, I got that. There's probably gonna be a ton of creepy crawlies between here and there that are gonna try to kill me. That's not gonna be pleasant at all. But hopefully we'll be able to. Make a few more fire when you know with the zombies, if that's what this game decided to hook me up with in the beginning instead of a pistol or something. Have a flare gun. Okay, let's take a look over here. Okay, looks like that's a dead end. Yeah, let's go back. Have another dead end in front over there, so I guess we're gonna go over this way. Nope, can't use the stairs sadly. Let's see. Ah! Oh, okay. No, no, that did not happen. You did not just hear me scream like a little girl. That was all in your imagination. Shame on you for imagining something like that. <sighs> okay. Oh, my heart's racing a little bit. We got blood over here. Never a good sign. Ooh, first aid kit. Cool. Oh, crap. Okay. 
Uh, is that my heart pounding or heart of creepy crawly? I don't like this. Let's should we open this, guys? Okay, let's give it a shot. Hopefully, we won't die horribly. Okay, seems to be clear. It's a crazy bathroom with doors closing themselves. <sighs> Yeah, screw that, I'm not going over there, you go over there. Let's try to make our way on over here. Okay, I don't like those sounds though. Okay, let's jump down, hopefully we won't die from the jump itself, because you never know in games like this, honestly. Okay, why do we have clouds on the ground? What the- oh crap! Okay, get my flare gun. There we go. Come on. Come on, hit him. Oh crap, so this dude doesn't die. That's great. Invincible zombies right from the very start. That's, that's perfect. Let's try to run away. Oh, do we just have to get in here and the zombie would stop chasing me? That would be awesome, really. That's all I have to do. Okay, so I got a camera with a flash. A lot of good that's gonna do. And it looks like we can scare the zombies with the flash of the camera. That's pretty cool. Oh crap, he's back. There we go, take that. Did just go away. Okay, so it looks like it doesn't scare them, it just stuns them a little bit. Makes it perfect. Let's get out of here. I hit invisible. Invincible. Oh crap, seriously, it's locked. Great, I have to find a key. This is crazy. Oh, he brought a friend. Well, of course, why not? Oh, come on, just let me get out of here. Okay, let's see. This guy looks soaked in whatever. There we go. Stop hitting me, you bastard! The monster dropped something that looks like a key. Yes! Okay, let's grab the key. Leave me alone. Stop hitting me, bastard. Hopefully now we can open the door. Yep, there we go. Perfect. Let's try to get out of here. D -d 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 leave me alone. Oh crap, not another one. That's just... Just great. Okay, what do we have to do? Oh, hurry, hurry, hurry. Oh, and of course, another one. So three invincible zombies right from the very beginning. Why? Does that not surprise me? Let's see, is this the elevator we have to get to? Of course the broken button. Why isn't the button broken? Oh crap, let's get another aid, first aid kit. Something tells me I'm definitely gonna need it. There we go. Bastards, leave me alone. And now I'm cornered. Great. Come on. What? E. Okay, use, use, use. Uh, the elevator is coming, but I'm not sure I'm gonna survive that long. Let's try to draw them away actually from the elevator. Stun them over here. Would be nice if we can actually stun all of them. Yes, that's not gonna happen. Come on, you crazy elevator, get down here already. There we go, there we go. You stay out here. Okay, I'm just gonna go. And, uh, I'll see you later, okay? Don't worry, I'm coming back, I promise, just... There we go. <sighs> okay, finally I can relax a little bit, looks like we just about made it. With probably just a sliver of health. Okay, so they managed to make a pretty intense game, and I actually like that it managed to scare me once. Hasn't happened in quite a while. I think the last game that actually managed to bring out some scares in me was Fear. The first Fear. Nothing else since then, so... It's very nice. Let's try to sneak like that. We have a sneak button. Let's try to use that, because I noticed some more creepy crawlies on this. Who the hell is this? Yes, the casino is on the other side of the pool. By the way, there is swarmed with these monsters. Well, of course, why wouldn't it be? I need to find a way to scare the vampires. Oh, now they're vampires in order to reach the casino. They don't look like vampires to me. They look more like zombies. I don't know why. This game insists on them being vampires. Okay, I'm there. Well, that's very thankful. Thanks a lot, dude. Very helpful, dude. Oh, crap. Oh, just, just leave me alone, no. I still don't understand what's with this. Oh, I think I get it. Hang on a second, there we go. Ok, 
Okay, so let's try to bring out my third amount. Okay, I get it. So those aren't clouds. Those are actually pools of whatever. And he's still not dying, okay? Oh, finally. So I found a way to kill the invincible zombies. Or vampires, or whatever the hell they are. That's awesome. Okay, I think I'm just gonna end it here. I don't want to go in there. No, 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 no. You're not gonna make me do that. Forget it. it. Scared me enough for one day. So, there you go, guys. This has been a look at Dark Ocean. I like the game quite a lot so far. I think I'm gonna keep playing it. Uh, as I've said, the game is free. You have the links in the description. Go ahead and play it. Go ahead and vote for it on uh, Steam Greenlight. And that's that. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you've enjoyed it. Don't forget to leave me your thoughts and questions in the comments below. And until next time, you go and have yourselves an awesome day, guys.